Hey. Oh, oh, mom wants to FaceTime. Hello? Are you getting your hair done? Yeah. I'm vlogging too. Huh? I said I, you're on my vlog too. Oh, right now? Yeah. Like this? Okay. Say hi. What's he doing in there? He just woke up from a nap. <laughs> he doesn't know who I am. Yes, he does. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is so funny. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder if I can show the other one. Chase playing the new mom today. <laughs> Sprint on our devices. <laughs> Gonna get you some more followers. Oh my gosh, she's so funny. First of all, Good morning, guys. Yes, I sound like a man. <laughs> my friend works at Sprint, and so she's putting my YouTube channel on all the devices <laughs> at Sprint right now. Hey, baby, you want to be on the movie? <laughs> so we are very sick. Actually, we're not, like, too bad. Oh, you poor baby. He started getting... No, we're not breastfeeding right now, honey. There's like nothing left in there hardly. He started getting a goop, like goopy eyes. And so I um, called the doctor and they said, it was like Friday and they said, oh, you know, it's probably just from a cold. Just keep an eye on it and like take him in on Monday if it's, it hasn't gone away yet. So it hasn't gone away. So I took him in, today's Tuesday. I took him in yesterday and um, they weren't that bad yesterday, so she said that she didn't want to give them any ointment because, like, sometimes that can irritate their eyes even more than, sorry, sometimes that can irritate their eyes even more than um, fixing it, so they decided to just not do anything, so he's not on any medication, but his eyes are just, like, pink-rimmed, and they're, like, goopy, and it's really, really sad, and he seems to be feeling okay. <laughs> He wasn't yeah. feeling well, like that well this weekend, but like today he seems to be feeling pretty good. Um, and then I caught something, so I'm not sure if I caught what he has, but I just have like a mild cold. It's really not super bad, but I did lose my voice. And like in the morning, when I first wake up and like swallow, ow, um, it hurts and then like it's really bad. But then like as the day progresses, it's, it gets better. So that's what we're situation is right now. I got the cold buster yesterday was my birthday, 28, um, and I just like cleaned the house and got groceries, and I had this had no voice. So I got the cold buster drink from Starbucks yesterday, and it's like a hot tea, and it was so good. And I'm like tempted to like leave the house just to go to Starbucks and get that today. Um, so I'm not sure because it was really good. I kind of want to buy those teas. It's Tea Havana. So I want to buy those teas and make them myself. We put our tree up. So I'm so excited. If you guys watched my vlogs last year, you saw our big white tree. The only thing is like some of the lights burned out on here. So I have to get some replacement bulbs. I thought I got some yesterday, but apparently I got the wrong ones. So we can't start decorating it until it, until I fix that. So that's another reason why I kind of need to get, get out of the house today. I just don't know. Um, oh, let me show you also what I got. Actually, David got it. Where's the light? Okay, look at this. I'm super excited. If any of you guys have this, let me know. This, my husband won this at work, like for an auction or something. So it's pretty cool. It does like single serving coffee cups. But it uses like regular ground up coffee and it does cold brew, all this other stuff. But it looks super confusing. I'm used to my simple Keurig, so I'm not really sure. Um, seems really confusing, but I don't know. But I think I'm going to try to set it up today and set it like up over here. And then we'll just have two different ones, I guess. We'll see. And these are the flowers that David got me for my birthday. They're so pretty. They have like a little scarecrow in them. I love them. 
And then for my gift, if you watched my Vegas vlogs, um, he got me a Michael Kors purse. So that was like my birthday present. Okay, I just put Cal's lunch together. We always eat at the tea room, and this is what he gets from there, and he's obsessed with it, so I'm trying to copycat it at home. They use a rye and pumpernickel swirl bread, and then turkey and white American cheese. So I got the ingredients, and I made it myself, and let's see if he loves it just as much as he does at the restaurant. All right, it's coming along. I'm watching an infomercial on it, so I can kind of like understand what it's supposed to do, but so far it comes with this is really cool so it comes with like a big coffee pot so if you wanted to brew like for a bunch of people or you can i think you can choose your size yeah so you can do a regular cup a travel mug which it comes with a travel mug a half a pot or a full pot and then you choose classic brew rich brew which is like heavier stronger or over ice, which is gonna be really, really strong, so that way it can go over ice and takes in consideration of the melting ice. So I'm doing an infomercial now, <laughs> but how cool, I'm so excited. Let me know if any of you guys have this and what your favorite ways to make coffee are with it. Oh, and it comes with this little thing like froths your milk. I'm so excited. What a fun gift, and it was free. Okay, so I'm trying to put this in here, and I'm so dumb. I'm like trying, I'm like, it just barely reaches. I can just slide this whole thing over. I'm so dumb, but look how nice it looks so far. It was really hard to fit in here because it barely fits. I had to like move it all different ways. Okay, now I'm just rearranging my entire house. Oh my gosh. Do you guys ever do that? Like you get one thing? And then it turns into like you have to like rearrange and reorganize everything. That's what I'm doing. Good job. My turn. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, we're taking a break from working, huh? <laughs> Cal invented this game. Oh, you were so close. Steady. Good job. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. I figure I might as well try this out right now. Let's do rich brew because I'm gonna put some milk in it. And I put it on a cup. Okay, now what? Oh, it's going. Interesting. Okay, I'm gonna try this frother. Okay, this, whoa, why is it beeping at me? I stopped. Look at this frother, this thing is legit. <gasps> Look at that. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Do you wanna try your new uh, vitamin? Uh. And try it. Ooh, is that good? Is that good? <laughs> Yum. Okay, so I just got Cal's multivitamin and I'm super excited because it's a multivitamin and a probiotic in one. So I'm really excited. It comes in these chewables. They're, they look pretty large and hard, but they're actually pretty soft. Like I just, I just broke it up with a spoon. 
and you saw him, he just took the little pieces and ate them just fine. So I think that's so awesome. I just tried one too, they taste really good. But I think that's so cool that now he can have a probiotic and a multivitamin in one chewable form and it's like so amazing, it's all natural. I read, um, I read a lot about like the gummy vitamins and all that stuff and they say if you take, if a child takes a gummy vitamin, they end up ingesting like four and a half pounds of sugar over the course of one year. That's crazy. So I'm super excited for him to try this one now and I think it'll help tremendously with his health. I try to give him um, the adult probiotic, like I would break up the capsule, but I would forget a lot and it's kind of a lot of work. So now I have a super easy way for him to get a probiotic in every day. I did try also, I did try drops, like Target sells some of the drops, but again, like I would forget a lot and also they got so messy and they would like stain his clothes because he would like insist on using the dropper himself and it would like get all over his clothes and like stain everything. So I kind of gave up on those <laughs> as well. So now we have this super simple, I'll just crush it up and put it on his high chair with breakfast every morning. Yay! All right, my house is legit trash right now. I've got stuff over there. I tried to start moving this thing and I got stuck on the carpet. I think I'm gonna put it over here. But then I don't know if that'll be weird having all of that and then that right there because they'll like kind of bump into each other. So I might move this table like behind my couch. I don't know, I have to play around with it. But basically, I was setting up this coffee bar, which I love this hutch for coffee. It's like perfect. I keep my coffee maker and like all my K-cups and mugs in there. It's like the best um, situation for a coffee bar because I don't like to put stuff like out on the kitchen counter. So the thing is, is as I was setting it up, I remembered that we are getting like all this new furniture from my, hi, from my grandma because she's moving into like a one bedroom apartment and she now lives in like a three story house so she has so much furniture to get rid of. So me and my siblings all got to like go and pick stuff. So hashtag blessed. I'm so excited for new furniture. Um, we're getting like new bedroom furniture and like um, a new dining room table in here and then a huge hutch that'll probably take up like most of this wall. So that's why I was like, okay, well I just, I better just move it now instead of like setting it all up and then doing it and then having to move it. So I think Thanksgiving weekend we like are hiring movers out there and they're gonna like, I guess we're gonna like drive a moving truck back to our house cause like we're literally, we're, like, we're getting a washer and dryer. Like we're getting tons of stuff from my grandma, I'm so excited. Um, so yeah, now my house is a mess cause I got this, all the stuff that was in it. Just everything everywhere and I am like stuck because I can't move it any, any further. David's gonna get home and be like, what are you doing? All the coffee stuff is over here. That coffee, by the way, was absolutely amazing. And then Cal is playing in the Tupperware drawer. My life. Oh, your poor little eyes. I don't know, I might have to call the doctor again. I feel like he does need the drops. I feel like you do need the drops. Poor baby, are you ready for bed? No. No? Go night night? No. Okay, so I made chicken and potatoes and cheese and green beans with onions and garlic. Look yummy, honey? Yeah, what do you put on the chicken? Oh my gosh, every time. I just wanna show you guys, I make this gourmet meal, perfect. And then David oh. over here adds- More perfect. Marinara to the chicken yeah. and ketchup to the potatoes. <laughs>